some Kyoto guidelines put out by the Kyoto Tourism Board and the police of Kyoto has some simple things to mind your manners when in Kyoto. Now, if they have to do this type of thing, you know that the tourists are a bit mm, unruly or out of control or they need to let them know. Move like a local. Shh, be considerate. Don't follow the crowd. Leave your luggage behind. Be eco-friendly. Bring a reusable bottle and shopping bag. Don't litter, okay? Help keep Kyoto authentic. Like don't damage the cultural heritage sites and support local culture. And the last four here are please don't stop Disha on the street. Don't take photos without permission. This has become a problem in Gion district here. Uh, keep out. No photos were prohibited. Don't block the road. No smoking on public streets. Well, a lot of this may sound like common sense, and it is. I uh, think you see more and more tourists acting out in the wrong way and not having good manners. That's how they say. When in Kyoto, mind your manners. I was walking down this side street next to my hotel here in Kyoto, and I thought we'd cover a couple of little fun facts. Three fun facts about in Japan, knowing a little bit of etiquette and do's and don'ts. One is, yes, the vending machine. Well, this is the hot side, the red side, this is the cold side. That may be obvious. In Japan, uh, you really don't see that many trash bins on the sidewalks and going around. So if you need a trash bin, you often do. Yeah, 7-Eleven convenience store or at the vending machine. You'll usually find a trash bin there. Absolutely. The next fun little tip is, or fact is that um, I looked at this parking spot here and I thought, oh, that's interesting. There are four spaces there, one, two, three, four, and they are numbered from where? Right to left. Number one is here, number two is here, number three is here, and wait, where's number four? There is no number four here. Why isn't there a number four? Well, many of you probably know four is an unlucky number. That's right, because it sounds like death, she. So, Japanese read from right to left. So you would park in place number one, you would park there, two, three, and spot number five. That's that one. Now, the last little tip I was thinking about was that if you smoke, um, you are not allowed to smoke walking on the streets in Japan. You'll quite often be fined up to $2,000. So you will usually find a little smoking space where you stand and smoke. And it's the same with the vending machine. It's good manners to just drink your drink at the vending machine. Yeah, you'll see some people walking around drinking, but good manners means you shouldn't. Good manners means you shouldn't um, smoke walking down the street, right? That's all for today.